Right then, I'm in the field with the sheep. There's Crook's Peak up there, look. I just come down that track, right up there. People having their photographs. It has worn a lot there. There's a big chunk that fell off, which was its sort of hooked nose. Um, I don't know if it's, they've tried to repair it, but it's definitely. Anyway, I mean, this lovely field. There's Banwell Wood, look. Western Hillfort, right over there. I do sometimes come across this field if there's no cows or um, what do you call them? It's a big hollow outlet. I wonder what that was once. Could have been mining. Could have been mining hollows or could have been a residential. The alternative to going back the way I came is to climb up that hump there. Once you get up that though, it's straightforward. But there's something nice about walking in open fields. It sort of reminds me of my childhood a lot. I'm just going to stop here for a Convenient dip, that's what I call a convenient dip. Right over there is Sanford Quarry, which I was up the beginning of this week. I was up the top there, right up there, taking photos, but it was a dull day, so they didn't come out very well. Well, they came out dull. I'm trying to help relax as much as I can. Get my arms exposed. Let them have some air. Hello, sheepies. All right.
So I'm walking through this lovely field, everyone. They sometimes have ponies in here. Sometimes they have cows in here. The big herd of beef cattle have moved over onto a hill about there. They've moved away from the track. And they're lying down, a lot of them. That's what I've got to climb. That'll be the last climb of the day. If I go that way. I think I'll have time. Oh, I've got to remember to get a paper when I get back. And, um... They might even do a small bottle of Prosecco in there. Mm. Hey, yeah. Oh. It's all right, ma'am. I'm just going to walk gently by. Just walking gently by, it's all right. You don't have to move or be frightened. See, I'm moving away, look. Moving away. Over out for a minute, over and out for a minute. Right, full circle folks. I came up this field from right down Right, there's Crook's Peak. Seems a long way off now. I stood on the top of that an hour or so ago. And there's the Somerset levels all the way around. All the way around till you might see Glastonbury Tour in the far, 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 and we must sit over there. There it is. Here we come, the people are picking up all the race markers and um, stuff now. People come in, get a move on. More video, and I'll see if I get to the trick point for anyone else. Um, yeah, that was just um, markers, people that they, you know, for these events to happen, you've got to have people dedicated to do all that sort of thing. I mean, some of them could have been professional athletes. 
past me on their bikes in all sorts of places today. Yeah, all sorts of places they pass me. When I get to, after I get to the checkpoint afterwards, I gotta go downhill, and it's all downhill. No hills. And I can't remember who said it, but somebody said doing hills are good for you. It clears your lungs out and makes them work. It's good for your cardiovascular system. Doing a hill. Yeah. Oh, it's been beautiful. I just love being out. Oh, I need to stretch my body anyway. Extend it. At 69 and a half years old. I have to. No, I don't have to keep pushing it. But I am. Um, my only thing is, is that I get a short breath a bit at times. But I haven't had to use my inhaler today. Nope. I haven't had to use the inhaler at all. I find I have to use it more at home. Being trapped in a box makes you breathless. Even though I put fans and that on. When you live in a shared building, you've got to put up with cooking smells, people who smoke. Oh, air pollution any from roads. Right, here we go folks. Checkpoint. I might take a photo of myself for a change. I haven't done one today. There's Axbridge. Reservoir, look. See? With all the little sloops on it, the little yachts, dinghies, whatever you want to call them. to be able to tack to the wind today. Yeah, I've cycled and walked around that reservoir before now. That's a nice walk, actually. Right, they're not far to go now. Not far to go now. There's Sanford over there, Quarry and Hills, and then up to the Fort area where I was at the beginning of the week. I'll just zoom into it. That's Rowbarrow Hill Fort and I stood right on the top of that on Monday. It's Saturday to now. I kind of went all around the edge of it. Then I wandered in and out of Rowbarrow Warren and back to Winscombe through a dangerous herd of cows. No more cows now. Right, over and out.